Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. 90 Day Fiance Alam Jibri Bell is claiming he is dead while he watches his wife, Miona Bell, post about her mystery man. Jibri was an interesting addition to the franchise after his season 9 debut with Miona. Jibri and Mayona were compatible and never spent a moment apart. The couple had met in Serbia while Jibri was performing there with his band, Black Serbs, and Mayona was in the audience. They experienced a few hiccups leading up to their wedding, where Mayona married Jibri in November 2021 and moved to Palm Springs. Mayona launched her own business after the final and started selling wigs online. Jibri was an integral part of Mayona's life as an entrepreneur, up until she removed all her photos and videos with him from her page. Next, it was Mayona's ring that went missing from her hand, followed by Mayona Hassoff launching her new boyfriend on Instagram. However, if Mayona's recent posts have been cryptic, they are no match for Jibri, who thinks that his coming to India has led to his death. In September 2023, Jibri shocked his Instagram followers by revealing he was in Malaysia. Jibri said he was in Kuala Lumpur and had been there for the last 24 hours. He said he'd already fallen in love with the people and the culture thanks to the locals there being kind and welcoming towards him. Jibri said he hadn't explored much of Southeast Asia before, so he asked fans to tell him where he should go. Jibri was rarely seen without Mayona before this. Fans commented, where is Mayona why y'all traveling without one another? But he refused to answer any questions. Jibri's October 19, 2023 post had him revealing his monk fade. Jibri posted a video of him shaving all of his hair off. Apart from getting rid of his hair, Jibri also shaved off his eyebrows. In his caption, Jibri explained that getting rid of one's hair serves as a symbol of renunciation in the Thai Buddhist culture. Jibri may have thought of his act as being symbolic of him getting rid of Mayona, or perhaps getting rid of her memories if it was she who decided to end things with him. The same Jibri who wore the most colorful and ridiculous outfits on 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 is now wearing plain white clothes and decided he was going to live like a monk in Thailand. Jibri recorded a video of himself sweeping the ground in a Vipassana center. Someone told Jibri that he looked great before, and replied that he shaved his eyebrows as a symbol of worldly ego and fashion. Jibri explained that to him. Living life to the extreme meant that he was waking up every day in his California castle, and deciding which of his three luxury cars he was going to drive to Starbucks. Jibri recalled how wearing designer clothes and jewelry had become a habit for him. He wanted people to notice him for how he looked when they saw him on the streets. Jibri wanted them to approach him after seeing him on TV or social media and complimenting his appearance. Jibri said he was chasing fame and fortune as I run around America in circles searching for more possessions and power, but now feels light and free after letting go of his materialistic possessions. In November 2023, Jibri made another drastic change to his appearance. Jibri wanted to get a tattoo on his bald head. He wrote that he received his most important tattoo from a Sakyat master monk. Jibri wrote that traditionally, these tattoos were exclusive to monks and warriors only and were believed to imbue wearers with things such as special powers, protection, and good fortune. The tattoos created using a sharpened metal stick were believed to bring luck and good fortune to the wearer while protecting them from harm. Fans believed Jibri had gone off the rails after this antic, but there was more to come. A few days later, Jibri declared that he had lived one of the craziest days of his life. Jibri had to fly out of Thailand on an hour's notice because he had to travel to Makassar, South Sulawesi province, to save a princess. Jibri confessed that he wasn't going to elaborate on this adventure, but assured his followers that he would always be around as a friend if they ever needed him. 
Jibri said that one could always count on him to show up and fight. Take risks, meet new people, say yes, venture out of your comfort zone. Lev, breathe, play, inspire, he wrote in his comments. In January 2024, Jibri announced he had lost 33 pounds since embarking on his spiritual journey. Jibri mentioned that he used to weigh 213 pounds when he left America and had 20% body fat. In 2024, Jibri weighs 180 pounds and has 10% body fat. He advised his followers that they could also occasionally reshape their lives by cutting out the toxins and unnecessary junk. Jibri explained that while it would be difficult, it can be done for their...